this video lecture i am going to discuss what how to create run and debug angular app using visual studio code so let's see all the important steps node.js in the windows operating system so write in google search box here node then you should move to node.js org site click on this download so you can download 16 version and 17 version anyone whatever you want you can download so this is recommended so i am going to use the 16 version so click on this button then you can get here the file that comes the size is 27.1 mb click on this start download so file is now downloading only 6 second is left to complete the download process so first two thing is we need to download the node.js and this is the msi file so it's uh, completing and uh, now it's uh, done let's click on this open so this is now installation steps for node.js okay so first two thing is we need to download and install the node.js now you can get here setup wizard so click on next and i accept next and this location node.js going to install next 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 install now you can see this is the here node.js setup and <coughs> this is doing the installing node.js so i think 70% uh, that's uh, completed so it's done here after that uh, the next is uh, here we need to check the node.js so let's open the command prompt so if you write here node minus v then you can get the version of the node.js so 16 version so in your case and here it may be different now the next is i'm going to install the type script so first is node.js and here so you can use this tools command anyone whatever you want so i'm going to use here npm i typescript z to install the typescript so now paste that and press enter for this one net must be connected and here you can get ideal tree npm is still i did so it's all depending upon your net speed so now you can see added one package and audit so first you should use this command to install node.js sorry typescript after installing typescript and node.js we need to install here or uh, angular cli so this is the command so let's copy that one and uh, the next is here i'm using windows 11 operating system so here just write command prompt then you should paste this command press enter so for that one next to uh, internet must must be connected because it will do some download process also so here this is the npm install minus g angular cli so it will take uh, some times so i'm going to pause the video two minute times here you can see this is angular cli cli that installed and added 191 package and audited 192 package in 46 seconds now the next is so here we need to check the version so for this one we need to use the command ng minus minus version so here you can see angular cli and uh, this is the detail about the angular cli and this is os that work on windows 32 64 and this so, is the package and this is the person now after that to uh, doing this one so we need to create the project so ng and new then after give the project name so giving the project name 
NG new and this is a project name. Press enter. So would you like to add? So right here Y in a small press enter. So now here you can see some uh, process is going on and uh, this is here yes so you need to wait for few second times to create this project is installed successfully and after doing this here let's write ng then after if you write minus serve then you can uh, get this all details so here available command add then after build analytics this is also angular command if i write here ng then here serve press enter so i'm getting this message angular project related things so first we need to use the cd command then give the project name so angular and here that i just created a project angular project press enter change after that here let's write ng this time here serve press enter and wait for few second then you can see generating browser application bundle this all those things then after you can get here and let's open the visual studio code so after that uh, the next uh, thing is visual studio code then i created uh, one angular project on the c user and at this place angular project so this that i already created so here you need to import this one inside to inside the visual studio so for this one let's click on this file then open folder so that uh, is in the c drive then after here you should go user and uh, here this is angular project select this so uh, directory and click on this select folder and uh, you can see this all that so uh, come here here you can see src and uh, now you can get this option angular language service extension so click on this install and uh, here this is the rating so click on this install so for this one net must be connected to do the installing process of angular language service and uh, here this is the feature contribution and this is all details here the extension is recommended by all user current work space so i'm not getting i'm not going to wait this so here this is doing the installation process okay and uh, after that let's go there then you can here you can see this is main ts so first two uh, thing is so here you can see this is installing now let's go on the terminal and click on this run task so click on this npm start so here this is now uh, starting ng server and npm run start so generating browser application and phase set of and now this is building let's click on this follow link and uh, you can see angular project and you can get this all details that means uh, here that is working correctly angular project in your visual studio code so this is the way we can run the angular project so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you